Hello, welcome everybody to the Tuesday evening stream. Hello, Softia. Good afternoon. Or should I say good morning to you? Hello, everybody. We are playing once again Sherlock Holmes versus Arsene Lupin. Welcome, everybody, to the stream. It is a wonderful evening stream. Are you up to date on this game, Sophia? Have you watched the streams? So, oh, illegible writing, yeah, we got this uh, piece of message from the storeroom behind the gates. It is illegible, we have to make it legible, guys. I don't know how, but maybe it has something to do with the plates. <laughs> but the blue plate, the blue bird, blue items to attract the blue bird. I remember that. But anyway, uh, this is... The kitchen, storeroom. All of these products are stamped with a royal coat of arms. Right. What is this? Sunflower seeds. They are a delicacy to certain birds. Oh, how did I miss this last time? All of these products are stamped with a royal coat of arms. So we got a message from behind this gate here. There's nothing in there except uh, some yucky looking. Sausages? <laughs> Blood sausage. Fried chicken. Roast pork. <laughs> A delicacy, guys. Anything else we have to pick up? Just want to make sure. Oh, hold on, what is that again? Oh, sunflower seeds. Birds do like sunflower seeds. So the objective right now is to get a hold of six birds, guys. Six birds. They are all at different locations inside this Tower of London. So I think we have found uh, two, or actually three, two or three. I don't quite remember. We find the locations, guys, but I have to get a hold of them somehow. So that is what's going on right now. Look, Holmes, jars of tomatoes from Italy. Mmm, they must be delicious. A few drops of red wax. They are from the jars of tomatoes. It's very suspicious, guys. The red wax spilling outside the jar. I've said it last time too. <laughs> very suspicious. So don't know what is that about. Isn't that okay? Hold on. What is that? Is that there's a white piece of uh an object here? What is this? Is that important? Huh. I don't know. <laughs> Potato size. So that is the storeroom. We've also been into um, the cooks or the chefs, the head chefs' room, the bedroom. It's in one of the buildings here, guys. So there is a bird in the shrubbery here. Inside the shrubbery. Do you hear it, Holmes? Hmm, a strange call, like a series of cracks alternating with smooth notes. The cries seem to be coming from the shrubs. Right. How about one of these trees here? Have we found any birds here? <laughs> I know there's one on the wall outside. This uh, main area. On top of one of the buildings. Birds, birds, birds. What do you say, Watson? What do you think they are?
No signs of birds. Alright, how about we... Go... Back... There's a clock room! Have we been into the clock room? Closed. Oh, it's locked. Nice. This is the dormitory. Is, is that the same one that we've been in? Is this the same one? Yeah, it's the same one. We've been here before. Why don't we take a look around again? <laughs> Just want to make sure that we have picked up all the items. The guard's uniform. What is that? What is that? Oh, I'm missing items, guys. A dirty sock. Rather unsavory. A sock that was left behind. What scandal. One of the guards deserves a punishment. We have more important things to deal with, Watson. Do they wear blue socks? We have a blue paint, and we have a blue sock. Ah, blue items, guys. I'm sure one of these birds love the color blue. But like a blue jay, <laughs> that rhymes with blue. Interesting, a camera with a magnesium flash. I feel like I need to repair this. Interesting, a camera... Using a flash to distract one of the birds. Possibly, guys. Bookshelf! Have we gone through the bookshelf? I don't quite remember. I guess we have. Nothing in the shelves, in the drawers. Alright, Watson. Main staircase. This is a shortcut. So I think this goes back to the beginning area. If I'm not mistaken, guys. So, oh, this passageway, guys. What is this? We have more trees this way, though. Have we gone up these stairs before? I don't remember this. What is that? What is that? We do have a map. <laughs> Let me check the map here. This place is huge. Where are we? We don't have a pointer here, guys. So I don't know where I am. <laughs> uh -huh, The barracks. Hospital block. Bloody tower. Queen's house. Scaffold sites. Oh, storeroom is here. Ah, uh, so that means... The clock room is somewhere near here. The There's a queen's house there. Eh? Just the name of uh, that particular section. I think this is where the store, uh, where the clock room and the dormitory is, right here. The whole complex is called the Green, uh, the Queen's House. Ramparts. Oh, the middle, the middle building is this one, isn't it? Oh, does it have a hotspot? It does not. But if we get closer to it, then maybe we'll get a hotspot. Whoa! A bird is hiding in one of the trees. Ooh, the song ooh. is quite lovely. There's a bird here! This bird is apprehensive. I mustn't get too close. Otherwise, I'd run the risk of it flying off and never returning. I'd like to know which bird it is. I have to attract it. I can't even see from here. <laughs> How do I attract a bird that I cannot see? Can I get a... Um, uh, a pair of binoculars. <laughs> I need a closer look. I want to attract the bird. Oh, anyway. The famous White Tower. Oh, this is the White Tower in the middle, guys. Does he not get a hotspot? 
Can we go in? Such a prominent building, guys, right in the middle of the Tower of London. This is the arsenal. Close. And it's locked. No complaint from me, guys. This place is huge already. <laughs> this is huge enough. Ooh, that looks like another prominent building. And it's inaccessible. Oh, the White Tower has multiple entrances, guys. Can I go through the... I don't think so. They do not look interactive. Okay, hold on. Let me look at uh, some of the items here. Some flower seeds. Where do I... Okay, you know what? What are the birds? May require these uh, sunflower seeds. We were to lure them. Blue items. So this is where I read about the blue items. I totally forgot about these guys. So there's a blue bird of paradise here. That likes blue items. Uh, blue is the only color that the bird's eye can distinguish. So if we place... They construct little grass and twig cabins that they decorate with flowers and rocks. Do I use those blue items in the strawberry, guys? If they like... The grass and stuff and twigs. Is this where the blue bird is? Do you hear it, Holmes? I know, I know. Do you what? hear it, Holmes? Hmm. A strange call, like a series of cracks alternating with smooth notes. The cries seem to be coming from the shrubs. Can I place the items down here? Those blue items that I have. I'm going right in the shrubbery, guys. <laughs> I'm dancing with the birds. Is there a spot where I can put down the items? Impossible. To oh, it's right here. These oh. shrubs are impenetrable. I see prints, little tiny, tiny ball prints. I'd like to know which bird it is. I have to attract it. Using blue items. Sunflower seeds. No, this bird doesn't seem to like these seeds. Uh, the blue items. I'd like to know which bird it is. I have to attract it. Uh, yes. Canvas back. Ah! Uh... Oh, I can zoom in. What singular tracks these are? I'd like to know which bird it is. I have to attract it. Does that tell you anything, Holmes? Oh, uh, well, this tell this tells me that uh, birds have tiny feet, <laughs> tiny tiny claws. What singular tracks these? I'd like to know which bird it is. I have to attract it. Does that? What singular trap? I'd like to. Okay, Does okay, okay. Can, can can I? Uh, hold on. I think there's another spot here somewhere. What singular? Tra I'd like. Does that tell you? It's a special spot where you need to scan. What singular tracks these are? I'd like to know what does that I tell know, you I know, I know. So there are tracks here in the pages too. Which one does it look like? Blue 
Blue Birds of Paradise. Oh, oh, oh my god, I find another one. Another bird. I hear a bird, Holmes. You are right, Watson. Come, we'll have to climb to the wall walk. Oh, is that the same one? <laughs> oh, this is a spiral staircase. Oh, this is the same one. Right. We found this one already in the last stream. Have I tried this? This door here? <gasps> Is it named the door? Weapons? There is a weapons room. Is it locked? It's actually open. <laughs> wow. We found a new room. The weapons room. This collection of weapons is impressive. Are they accessible? This collection of weapons is impressive. Oh, you are Chris Tony. Oh, I remember you. I know you, my friend. I remember you. So, welcome back. Spear, pointy spears. This collection of weapons is impressive. There are some weird looking ones here, guys. How do you even use these weapons? How does this one work? <laughs> do you just put this around one's neck? That's the neck master. Oh, interesting looking book. A box of munitions, oh. empty. It's a what box. What the devil are you up to, Holmes? That is also blue, guys. We have a whole bunch of blue items now. Use all that to attract the blue bird. Traps. If I want to attract a bird with this call, I must know which bird to call. Oh my it god! That none of the calls will correspond. Uh, so bird call. Do I use this on the six birds? Is that one for the blue bird, guys? So all different names. Why is this set of uh, bird calls here inside the weapons room, guys? This Why? part is dedicated to medieval hunting. This part is dedicated to medieval hunting. Hunting birds. Bird hunters. This space is dedicated to the navy. This may prove Oh my to god. Binoculars. I know where to use it. Closed. Need to find that tree again, guys, and use it to uh, look at the bird. Anything else? Well, we have new items. Have we tried this door? Uh, I'm going to go find that bird now. We have binoculars. 
If I can remember the place. <laughs> it's somewhere around here. One of the trees, I believe is this one. Or somewhere close by, I don't know. So there are six birds. And we found maybe four? Or five? Okay, is this the tree? I don't think so. It's not the one around the fence. Oh, it's this one. Ah. Using my telescope. <laughs> These are not binoculars. This is a telescope. Ooh. Okay, do I know what's your name? Uh, hold on. That book, though, that book only has one entry. <laughs> okay, let me go back to the book. Remarkable bird from the five continents. There's only one entry here. Only talks about the blue bird. <laughs> only one. Actually, this is the second one here. The rock partridge. Um, only two entries. Maybe it is that one. It looks a bit like that one. Okay, let's say if it is that one, uh, I need to go pick the right bird call, the bird whistle now. So looking for uh, the cartridge. What is that? Oh, that looks out of place. Oh my god, what is this? Seed husks, it would appear. Lupin must have lured the ravens and then caught them one after the other. Oh. Wow. Okay, where is it again? Is is it that one? It's that one. <laughs> Is there one for the rock partridge? Blackbird Pheasant Partridge From Languedoc uh, Oh, we got this one here, Wood Partridge from Sardinia Rock partridge is going to be this one. This one is a wood partridge. This one is wood, uh, the rock. <laughs> rock. Okay, let's take that one. Okay, maybe it's that one. Does it have a name? Um, there's no, no location here, huh? Rock partridge. Sardinia. Sardinian. Forest. Sardinian forest. So the one that we have... Oh! Oh! It is one partridge! It says so in the prompt. Nice. Alright, good night. Chris Tony, good night. I must have made a mistake. Time to think. No, it's not that one. That's not the raw partridge.
is not that one. Wood partridge. Shall we try this one, Sardinia? Maybe it's this one. Sardinia forest. Impossible. I can only take one. I must choose well. I take that one. Oh, shortcut, guys. That's a shortcut. <laughs> Grey partridge. It is grayish in color. It's definitely a partridge. Catch it. Now. Oh. The message written on this paper is illegible. Another one? Hey, we got one already! So this, the first one, is uh, inside the soul room, guys. It's not attached to a bird. Oh, we finally caught a bird. There's one inside the canvas bed right now. <laughs> uh -huh. So we have gained another blue item. Shall we head back to the strawberry and try it on the bird? Three blue items. Do you hear it, Holmes? I do. No, I don't have enough items to attract this bird. Ooh. Will you ever explain it to me, Holmes? If you had read the reference work on birds carefully, you would know that we are dealing with a blue bird of paradise, my dear Watson. It seems so simple, Holmes. It is the right place. Okay. No, I don't have enough items to attract this bird. How many do we need? Hopefully three is enough. <laughs> we have three. Is oh, that is enough. Aha. Catch it, Watson. Catch the blue bird. Carefully. The message written on this paper is illegible. Well done, Holmes. Wow, two birds, guys. Four to go. <laughs> we actually caught two birds. I am impressed. Alright, so the thing is, do I need to use the other whistles? Uh, I know where another bird is. It's right on top of the building. But we have no entries on... We only have two so far. Only two entries and we caught them both already. So how do we figure out the rest of the four? The, the four birds. The remaining ones. Uh,
Well, the, the bird that we know about is where again? <laughs> it's hard to remember the location of these birds at. The, the buildings, they do look very similar. Um, I think it's this one. Yeah, it's right here. Yeah, this one is greenish actually. It's like green in color. I hear a bird, Holmes. You are right, Watson. Come, we'll have to climb to the wall walk. Yeah, only attracted by blue objects because the bird is a color blinded. <laughs> the, these birds can only see things that are blue. So that's why they are called the blue bird. <laughs> they only like blue objects. So the bird is up here. We've been up the steps already. But, ooh, what is that? Jewel house? I don't remember this. Closed. Okay, it's locked. No jewels for us tonight. So the bird is right here. A closer look house. I believe a bird on the roof is speaking, but I don't understand what it said. I must find a way to approach it. So... Can I take a closer look of the bird using my telescope? A closer look. Ooh, what do you look like? It is green. It's a green bird. Very greenish. It's like green parrot. <laughs> oh, the door is locked on the other side, right? Just want to make sure. I believe a bird on the roof is speaking. I know, I know, I know. So stairs to... Oh, that is the top floor. Okay, so the, uh, the steps... They do lead... Down to another floor. Does it go down? Yeah, it does go down. What is this then? I haven't been here before. Do you hear it, Holmes? What? I hear a strange screech behind this door, but the sound is weak. Another this door bird? is securely closed. Perhaps Smith could open it. Watson, could you fetch him? Understood, Holmes. Could this be another bird? In the dungeons? There, look, it's here. We can hear a strange noise from behind this door, but it's locked. Ah, this door. The prison. What is this? The basement bathroom. Can you open it? Certainly. To be honest, I was scared you'd bring me here. It's one of the oldest rooms in the fortress. Possibly dates back to before the official construction, because, as you know, Roman ruins were originally on this spot. It's a sinister spot in which we made some gruesome discoveries. We would have preferred to condemn it the men were scared half to death. Gruesome discoveries? Gruesome discoveries. How gruesome? Dead bodies. Oh, whoa, dead bodies, guys. Oh, this is a torture chamber. Isn't it? I, I'm hearing a bird. Oh, my God. There is a bird here. Wait, maybe it's just the one on the roof. Is it the one on the roof? It sounds so loud down here, guys. Or maybe there is one down here. I don't know. <laughs> the nooks under the shields are riddled with holes and grooves, which seem to have been created on purpose. The screeches are coming from this crack and seem to echo. Without a doubt, there is a room behind this wall, but there is no visible entrance. The oh. corner of this stone was a bit broken, and we tried to enlarge it with a pick. However, the stone is too hard, and having seen what was underground, we didn't want to pursue the endeavor. Who knows what is hidden behind the wall? A bird is hidden behind the wall. So the secret room, yeah, probably a very tiny entrance guide. The bird flew right into the opening, to the secret room. 
So we need to find a way to open the wall. It appears to be Latin, Watson. The inscription is almost completely worn off. Hanging above is a shield that we can't identify. A family crest. These bones are centuries old. Talk to the guard here. Hello. Uh, I need your help. Have you found something, Mr. Holmes? Do you have explosives? <laughs> you have dynamites inside the Tower of London. I need to borrow some here. <laughs> I need to destroy this wall. Like right now. This is a bird rescue. The bird is running out of air behind this. <laughs> the bird is dying. I need to get to you as soon as possible. So yes, I'm back. <laughs> a phone call. All right. So I can see these uh, shields here, family crest. These heraldic shields are almost completely obliterated. Watson, the symbols on the heraldic shields and this Latin inscription may permit us to get through to the other side of the wall. I must try to find something to bring out the contrasts. Understood, Holmes. Bring out the contrast. How? Alcohol. Rubbing alcohol. These heraldic shields. Are okay, okay, okay. Do we have anything we can use in our inventory, guys? Uh, the the lamp. <laughs> use a lamp. These shields don't mean anything. These heraldic shields are almost completely obliterated. Bring out the contrast. What are what are these holes here for, guys? For the torches. Wait, there are torches here. Can I remove this? Those I need to put something inside those holes. So there are three crests here, and oh, actually there are six, <laughs> three on each side. I need to place something inside these holes here. The nooks under what? the shields are riddled with holes and grooves, which seem to have been created on purpose. So what fits into the holes, guys? Bones. Have you found something, Mr. Holmes? Those things are probably not here. <laughs> I need to look for them elsewhere, guys. Code of Arms. So, ah, uh, this is uh, the bottom floor, huh? All right, we don't have the solution here. What can I use to place into the holes, guys? I don't know. I know you're trying to send me a message, but... I met one of your companions down below! <laughs> your sibling is hiding in a secret room in the basement. Can I try another bird call here, guys? On uh, that bird. There are so many bird calls, I need to try the other ones. Maybe...
Yeah, I'm going to see if I can take out another one or not. Can I pick up? Oh, we can now pick up another one. So this that's art that. is dedicated to medieval hunting. So the bird call is only for one bird out of the six. Okay, there are shields here too. I need to take a look at this. Or uh, uh, okay, let me take a picture of this. <laughs> I don't want to run back and forth in case I need this as a clue. So hold on, guys. Only five. Are there other ones? What is that? Only five here. Okay, only five. Well, there are family quests here too, from the fireplace. It's like a sequence. But these are very pixelated. <laughs> so I'm not sure if that is going to be a clue or not. This is a huge fireplace, isn't it? Almost like there's a secret passage behind this. Can it be opened up? Hotspot? Wait. Ooh. Oh, this may prove to be useful. Coal pieces. I can burn the coal pieces, can I not? But I don't think that is going to be... Um, used in those holes. I don't think so. They're more like levers. Lever control panels. Okay, so we confirmed that those bot cards won't be used anymore. Place is still very confusing. <laughs> one bird on the roof, one bird in the basement. So there are two more to go then. I thought we have found like five already, but looks like we have found only four. We caught two. So there's still two more to go. String, piece of string. Sunflower seeds. The, oh, haven't tried some sunflower seeds are very oily, guys. They are made into sunflower seed oil. Do I rub this onto those uh, crests? To make them more le or oh, use them on the writings here. Make them more legible. <laughs> use the coal pieces in the writings. The coal, the coal pieces. Is there a way to access uh, that door right there? This passageway, though. Spiral staircase. So that goes into the. Oh, the bird is here on this side, right? Oh, yeah. Okay, okay, guys. Okay. 
I'm going to go back up again. Have I tried a sunflower seeds on him? I don't think so. I believe a bird on the roof was speaking, but I don't understand what it said. I must find a way to approach it. I haven't tried a sunflower seeds yet. Oh, wait. Oh my god! Sunflower seeds! This is the right one! What's my name? What's my name? What's my name? What's my name? He Polly. Keeps asking what his name is. This bird seems to be remarkably well trained. How would I know your name? <laughs> your name is Polly. How can I find your name? Beautiful but impish. You search for her name. Long ago, on you, she played a trick. Or was it your heart that she did prick? German bird or eagle? They're one and the same. This bird is a talker, guys. <laughs> uh. All right, hold on. <laughs> can you? I must have made a mistake. Time to think. Can you tell me about you again? <laughs> tell me about yourself. <laughs> I need a clue one more time. Oh no! Please repeat what you have just said to me again. I must have made a mistake. Time to think. Where's the rewind button? <laughs> I need to play his voice message again. <laughs> okay, we just ignore it and use my uh, my bag. I don't have my duffel bag anymore, the sack, guys. How are we going to catch those birds? <laughs> what happened to the bag? Wow. Where can I find that name? It's not in the bo uh, in, in, it's not in this book here. There are only two entries here, and you are not one of the two birds. Hmm. All right, goodbye for now. Closed. Maybe the guard knows something. Let me talk to the guard. At last, Holmes. I haven't found anything of interest, but having heard the cries for so long, I am convinced that they are not those of a bird. <laughs> right. <laughs> have you found something, Mr. Holmes? I have found a bird, a nameless bird. Can you not help me out, please? The nooks under the shields are riddled with. Okay, you know what? Uh, let me try uh, the codes here. Stuff them into the holes. The nooks under the shields Ned. are riddled with holes and grooves, which seem to have been created on purpose. Do I just use it on the on the crest? These shields don't mean anything to me. Ned. Hmm, it's hard. Oh my God! Use it on the the writings as they are so foreign to me. Wait, I think I've already seen that coat of arms on one of our antique shields in the arms room. I seem to recall that Brigadier Medcalf explained the symbolism of these arms. If you show it to him, I'm sure he could share that information with you. He's either doing his rounds, or you'll find him in the dormitory. I'll take care of it, Watson. Stay here and see if you can make anything out of the Latin inscription. You're too kind, Holmes. Go on then. Dormitory then.
doing his rounds of the dormitory. One of the two. The way to the dormitory. The fastest way is here, guys. Actually, what the? <laughs> Why is it blocked off? Dormitory. Oh, there you are. Who goes there? Holmes, Sherlock Holmes. Are you Brigadier Metcalf? That's me. What can I do with you, Mr. Holmes? Uh... Huh? What? <laughs> can I ask you about something, please? Wait, you want me to use an item here now? What? <laughs> I thought... I can just ask him about the crest. Do I wanted to show this crest to him right now. Or do I need to go back to uh, the weapons room, guys? Oh, very strange. Well, uh, that other guard wants us to go back to the weapons room first. Right? <laughs> Maybe that's what we have to do now. And then we go back to that guy and ask him about that. And I just took a picture of those crests too. So that was utterly pointless. These are the ones, right? This shield resembles oh. that of the crypt. It appears quite old. Oh. Just remove that one. <laughs> Only that one, nothing else. <laughs> was that a pattern on uh uh on that quest too, the ones in the dungeon, the same one, the same design is on that too. Well, I guess we can just uh, use a map here. I can quick travel using these icons, can I not? I can quick travel, I didn't know that. I thought they were only hotspots. What can I do with you, Mr. Holmes? Aha! A topic. I've been informed that you know the origin of the coat of arms on this heraldic shield. Indeed. I'm no expert on the subject, but I do dabble in the Middle Ages. In short, I know that it's the coat of arms of the Round Table. Round Table Pizza? <laughs> Thank you. Think nothing of it. Back to my rounds. Yeah, you do that, please. So, okay, quick travel back now, huh? Oh, this is pretty convenient now. <laughs> Why haven't I not used this before? This quick traveling function. So we're heading back to um, the dungeon basement, Wickfield Tower. Yeah. It appears that the coat of arms is that of the Round Table. Strange, don't you think? No doubt the coats of arms on either side are those of knights or other heroes from Camelot. My intuition suggests that the Latin inscription is connected. Mr. Smith, would you have a book on King Arthur, Camelot, or the round table around here? No, I'm sorry. And there's no chance that any member of the staff would have one in their own possession. Watson, you must return to Baker Street and find Barnes, the bookseller. He usually works late, sometimes throughout the night, it seems, ever since we brought him back that book from New Orleans. If he isn't there, find him somehow and ask him to open his store. A reference work that can help us will certainly be found there. As for me, I'll stay here to decipher this cryptic inscription. As you wish, Holmes. One of the guards can take you in a cart, Dr. Watson. Very good, Mr. Smith. You take care of that, then return to see me. I will most assuredly need your knowledge of the place. We're actually going back. So Watson is heading back to Baker Street.
To the bookstore specifically. Aha! Baker Street. Barnes Bookseller. A knight! Look at a starry knight. Look at all those stars. Is the bookstore still open, guys? It's most assuredly closed. How will I find Barnes? I thought he lived above his shop. Perhaps if I called out. Barnes? Barnes! Open up Barnes! right now! Barnes! Barnes! Open up! Hey, are you thick? You'll end up spending the night in a cell if you keep this up. Such a racket at this hour. Hey, I recognize you. You're the detective's dog's body. I guess that with that coin I gave you, you bought yourself a keg of beer. Listen, young man, I am not a servant, I am a doctor. And the reason I am shouting at the top of my lungs is not because I am under the effects of alcohol, but because it is required by an affair the importance of which a mere pencil pusher such as yourself could not possibly begin to fathom. I beg of you, keep quiet, your lordship. I was merely trying to help your lordship avoid a disagreement with a police force. It is rather curious that a person of such standing as your lordship is howling in the middle of the night in order to hunt down a second-rate bookseller. Yes, I see. Well, since you seem to know everything, doesn't Barnes the bookseller live up there, on top of his shop? Would his lordship pardon me, but I'm a journalist, not a good Samaritan. You see, I sell my information, and you haven't named a price yet. I have a few coins, is it? I don't need your coppers, Doctor. Whatever is inside there isn't worth a yawn. But we could come to an arrangement if you give me your word as a gentleman that you'll help me out someday. Anything you wish. Uh, well, within reasonable limit, of course. Ah, it won't be anything difficult. All I want is to get a good scoop. Got it? I'll do what I can, but discretion is vital. I will be discretion itself. Listen, your friend Barnes had problems with his landlady recently. She claims he's been doing some strange experiments. He screams during the night. There's all kinds of strange odours. In short, two days ago, he had to move to a room at the Golden Lion. In that hideous dive? That's the place. He's there every night anyway. But the Golden Lion must be closed at this hour. Officially, yes. But you'll see... We're closed. A password. <laughs> Go on, Doc. No doubt you'll find your man inside. Until next time, Doctor. And don't forget your promise. My promise? What promise? What are you talking about? <laughs> Forgot already. <laughs> there is no such thing, young man. There wasn't any promise. Alright, so... Aha! Barnes, where are you, Barnes? You're not Barnes, you're only the doorman. Pardon me, <laughs> I'm looking for someone. I've been told... Scram, you drunkard! Whoa! Not very friendly, aren't you? Are you Barnes? Excuse me, sir? You're not Barnes. Shh, keep it down, mate. You'll blow me cover. You're what? Me cover, you deaf or ow. Who are you? But why a cover? Because I'm a bobby on a lowdown. I shush and all that. You don't say. It's a fact. I know everything about everyone I do. Including Barnes. I would assume that a professional of the police force such as yourself must know where to find Barnes. You know, the bookseller on Glentworth Street. <laughs> Look behind the d door at the back, next near the bar. Oh, okay, thank you, then. I'll take my leave, then. Fine, but shh. Thank you. Alright guys, 
I have to end the stream, it's getting very late. Well, we have made some progress, right? Not a whole lot, but I'm glad that we have... Uh, we gotten... Wait, how many birds did we catch? Two? <laughs> or three? Yeah, something like that. So let me manually save the game here. But I'll be back again. Another night. To continue this game. So thank you everybody for dropping by. Um... Uh, Enjoy the rest of your day. See you all next time. Goodbye.